So friends, you must have remembered that in one of the past exercise while we were working with the sheets, we learned how to link the sheets. Now we are again doing that with the help of data tables and see how convenient it is. If you remember, these were the sheet where the marks of the students were given here. There was an another sheet uh, I have opened up here. The semester 2 marks, here is the marks in semester 2. And there was a sheet uh, where the total marks are being fetched from the two semesters. How we have to do is we have to have a semester marks as we press equal to here. And then we go to the semester 1 sheet and click on this total marks first cell like this. And then we have to delete these dollar signs here. I hope you remember this. And then we have to press enter. After that, we have to drag this down. Right, to have these total marks in the sheet. Then for semester 2 marks, we have to click here equal to. And then we have to go to the sheet with semester marks 2. And then we have to select the first marks here and press enter. Right. And then in this 434, we have to press dollar signs. Right. And we have to press enter. And then we have to drag it down or double click here so that all marks have been calculated like this. Then we have to follow the process. Now let us try to do this with the help of data tables. First, we'll convert all the three tables into the data table and then we'll try to solve it. Now you see in the semester one, we click anywhere inside the table and then we press Ctrl T and enter. Now you see this becomes a data table. Then we go to semester two here and click on here and then we click on Ctrl T and then we click OK. Now this is converted to data table. And now we'll go to our file C. We'll go to the C file where we are having all the marks. And here within a table, we click anywhere in the table. Right? I'll reduce the size so that you can view it more clearly. I'll click inside the table, then press Ctrl T and press OK. Ctrl Z, some mistake happened. Uh, Ctrl Z, I click anywhere in the T and I press Ctrl T and into. Now this table is also converted into a data table. Now what we'll do is we'll have semester one marks. I'll click on this cell, cell C1 of the annual mark and press equal to. And then I'll go to semester one marks. And in semester one marks, I'll click on 476, right? And press enter, right? As soon as I press enter, the all marks comes up here by itself. Then go to semester 2 marks, press equal to and then I'll shift this a little and go to uh, sheet 2 where we are having a semester 2 marks and I'll go here and select the semester 2 marks like this 434 and press enter. Right. And I'm having a semester 2 marks by itself. Now you see all marks are there by itself. I didn't have to make any dollar sign delete or do or anything else. Right? All marks are there by itself. Now what I'll do is in the total marks, I'll click on the total marks and press equal to and have semester 1 marks plus semester 2 marks. Semester 2 marks and press enter. And now I'm having all the marks. You see uh, one more thing. I'll, I'll do it again to make it sure this equal to semester 1 marks. Now semester 2 marks are not visible to add on. So I'll click on the semester 1 marks itself and with the mouse. I'll move on to the semester 2 marks, right? And press enter. And all marks comes up here. To calculate the percentage, I press equal to have the total marks and again divide by 12 and enter. Now you see this process with the data tables becomes very easy.